I'm going to show you how you're able to remove those files that are not used in your computer yet they crowd your computer making it slow and hot so what you're going to do you go to this PC if you're using Windows 7 it can be computer but what is very important is where you are able to access your files so it's mostly you get a sign of a computer so you double click on it or you right click and select open so there is a specific disk where that the computer always uses for its activities so this is a, which is a disk c in my computer i have written it as windows c everyone can rename according the way you want so but what is very important is letter c is in brackets so if you find this computer is filled up there is a possibility that your computer is going to be very slow and the other thing we must note about windows or oh, this c drive here everything you have on in your desktop is going to be in this c or you have in your documents downloads so it's very important you don't keep most of your things on the desktop because it can slow down the processing speed of your computer so let's do what we want so we are you're going to right click on this C drive when you right click on this C drive you're going to click on properties so when you click on properties you are able to see this dialogue in this dialogue there are so many things that you can be able to do but our area of interest today is disk cleaner because we want to free up our disk so it even shows you the free space and the used space in your computer for example mine it shows 55 gb is used and i have 74 gb as free but still well, i want to clear up to show you what i can do yours may probably even be used up it could be red as we speak right now but after this process it will be able to clear so many things those temporary files you know there are so many of those things you're not able to see but they're in your hidden there in your computer yet you the computer actually doesn't use them so when this brings you click on disk cleaner you give it time depends on the processing speed of your computer or the ram others may run very fast others may slow down uh, what is very important is you wait up to the end so so mine has completed uh, the first step which is uh, this cleanup uh, when you look at this it even tells me that these are the files that need to be cleared I have downloaded programs temporary files and quite many of them and they show me the space that total amount of disk space you gain is 1.1 0 GB so they are telling me if I click OK here now I will be able to gain 1.1 GB but maybe I still want to clear something more than that because the first uh, step it will be able to get for us other disk files but also there are system files you are going to click on this clean up system files but before you click that you should note that the system files are only being cleaned up by an administrator. If you're using a standard account, it will require you to enter the password for administrator account. So, I'm going to click on this because me I'm using administrator, but you can as well use yours and enter the what? The administrator password. So when you click on that, it also takes the same process like the other one calculating as well as it's bringing up what is supposed to be cleared meanwhile please take your time and subscribe to my channel and remember to turn on notifications so that you are not going to miss on my daily posts and my daily solutions that i always post on this channel if you have your friends you can as well share it to them and be able to get this solution so you see mine has been able to complete even the the level of system files you may see this 
when I first ran the first one, it showed me the space I could clear was about uh, one point uh, something GB, but now it has increased because there is this previous Windows installation, it has also been increased. There can be others also that have been increased, that is under the system files. So when this all is done, the, what you're only going to do is click OK. When you click OK, it gives you like a warning. Are you sure you want permanently delete these files? Just click delete files. There you're good to go. It's now clearing the files that have no use at all in your computer. Yet they are slowing up the computer. As I said before, it depends on your the computer you're using others may have a very big ram the processing uh, speed could be bigger but if it is slow it will take time but what is very important all of them can be able to complete the process you only have to relax and be patient so you can see mine has been able to complete the process it is just that I've not I've always been doing cleanup, but you may see there is a difference the free space and the use space. That is shows something has been removed. Earlier before when I showed you I had about 70 something GB as free space, but now I have got 81.56. So you see this really works. I hope it will be able to help you. Uh, remember to subscribe and like this post thank you for watching and uh, hope you join up again next time bye